The time skip of One Piece saw all the major characters in the story from the up and coming generations take the next step and get stronger. Just like our main characters were training to grow stronger with certain people on their respective islands, other side characters also showed growth in their use of hakis and overall power level. So basically the time skip was an important time where the whole cast of the series grew stronger but it was much more important for the growth of two certain characters which we would have never guessed Trafalgar Law and Kobe of the Marines there was a particular incident that is mostly ignored by the fans but plays an important role in the story that's why this incident called the Rocky Port incident is quite easily one of the biggest event that took place during the time skip of the story As the name suggests the incident took place at a port called as Rocky Port of which the exact location is still unknown exact details of many parts of this incident are still shrouded in mystery but it is believed that it was started by none other than Trafalgar Law one of the members of the worst generation at this point law had a bounty of 200 million berries He had already made quite a name for himself in the North Blue and was known as the surgeon of death As Luffy was training with Raylink for his haki, Trafalgar Law was also trying to rise in power, for which he had some plans in his mind. At this point, he was keeping his plans to himself about things and events that later took place at Punk Hazard and in Dressora Arc. But before starting with his plans, the first thing that Law wanted to do was to attain the title of Shichibukai. To do this, Law set in motion a major incident at Rocky Port which came to be known as Rocky Port incident. At this port, it is believed that the Law stole hearts of 100 different pirates with his devil fruit powers and delivered them to the navy to make them happy. And thanks to this incident, he ended up becoming one of the seven warlords of the sea and made a great name for himself. As fans know this was all the part of Law's plan to promote himself to the status of Shichibukai and then eventually pave the way for the downfall of Doflamingo. At Punk Hazard Law joined hands with Luffy in an attempt to get Kaido to destroy Doflamingo for him. As such the Rocky Port incident eventually proved to be the trigger for all the major incidents that have been happening in the new world of One Piece. But there's a catch This wasn't the only thing that happened on the port. Another hero of this event was none other than Kobe, one of the Luffy's marine friend. After joining the navy, Garp, the hero of marines, took him under his wing and trained him. Even though his character development and growth has been rather very slow, he still grew stronger till this point in time. Under Garp and Bogard, Kobe trained relentlessly and ended up rising to the rank of petty officer. He had already mastered quite a few secret arts such as Ryokushiki by the time of the time skip. But the irony is that during the Rocky Port incident, Kobe was present at Rocky Port. At this time, Kobe showed his skills and became a hero by saving all the civilians involved in the incident. This led to him making a great name for himself as the hero of the Rocky Port incident. Furthermore, this could also have been a big factor in him becoming promoted to Sword. a secret organization in the navy of which the exact purpose is still unknown kobe also ended up joining hands with none other than blackbeard however it is unknown whether this was on purpose or whether his work ended up helping blackbeard anyway it was revealed in one piece 1059th chapter that while kobe was on the rocky boat blackbeard was also present there kobe's role in the rocky port incident paved the way for blackbeards to fight wang ji One of the former members of the Rock's Pirate, Wang Ji is the name of the real life Chinese pirate in our world who is famous for trading weapons with Europe, ASEA, China and Japan. So what happened? We can assume that the Rocky Port incident might not have occurred at the Pirate Islands which is currently occupied by the Blackbeard Pirates. It is most likely occurring somewhere else. And we can assume that Law was causing a scene with an unknown purpose that time. possibly related to 100 pirates hearts he gave to marines or him trying to disrupt do flamingo's underground deal with kaido so in short we still don't know how kobe helped blackbeard was it on purpose or kobe helped blackbeard without him knowing it is also implied that blackbeard ultimately ended up defeating wang zi and after took his place as the ruler of the island 
Ever since then, Blackbeard has taken control of the island and continues to rule it even today. In One Piece chapter 159, Blackbeard mentioned Kobe's role in the Rocky Port incident as quite convenient for him. Quite a lot of things about this incident remains unknown even today. However, Oda will most likely tackle them soon and fans will find out about the major events that unfolded during the day of Rocky Port incident. What are your thoughts about this incident? Let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section down below and if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel because I post daily anime content about top 10 top 5 listings, anime reviews, recommendations, news theories and all sorts of anime content on daily basis. So if you enjoyed please subscribe and that was it and I will see you in the next one. Sayonara.